And all new for you this morning, it's an annual Buffalo Strong effort, also a sure sign that spring is back. It benefits the hospice and palliative care center. 7 News reporter James Catato is outside that center telling us how you can help James just by buying some flowers. Yeah, Katie, absolutely. It's one of the biggest times of the year for the Hospice Care Center. That's where we are right now. We're in front of the Memorial Garden, and it's such an important time of year. Spring's coming out. We actually hear the birds chirping, and that means that it's time for their 37th annual spring bouquet sale. All proceeds going back in to hospice care from the event. So to break down the process for you, the volunteers come in the morning, pick up the boxes you see on your screen, and then deliver them to all of the pre-sale locations. When I caught up with the special events coordinator, she told me there were over 500 volunteers for this event every year. Although they don't get to see the smiling faces of the people who receive the flowers, they know the work they put in is well worth it. I think that's why all of us work at hospices. It's just so rewarding. I mean, it's such long hours and there's so much that goes into this event that people don't even realize. But at the end of the day, we know that it's helping patients and their families. So it's why we do what we do. So if you want to buy a regular bouquet of flowers, they're $12. If you want to buy a tribute bouquet, those are $35. I saw some of the flowers, Katie. They are beautiful. Again, it's making you think it's springtime and all proceeds going back into the hospice care community, which is just an amazing cause. Yeah, they do so much good for people here. James, thank you. Easy way you can help them.